This video is um, an overview of the components of a student profile. So to find a student profile from the dashboard, special education teachers and administrators can start typing a student's name. I'm trying to find Kelly. I start typing her first or last name, not both, and I will see her pop up and I will click her. So now I am in the student's profile. There's four main areas of the profile. The first one is just the general information here. So this is the personal information, the parent communication, preferences and contact information. We've got case manager and campus, disability information and IEP information. So this are the um, IEP due dates. The second area is the info, info tabs. We have the rest of the profile broken down into meaningful chunks. So we have strengths, we have special factors, we have goals, we have services, we have testing, this is state and district testing, and we have transition. So those info tabs um, are the second part of it. The third is the flagging option. So you can flag students for priority, non-priority. You can write notes to other team members about why this student was flagged and what action steps need to be taken. And you have um, access to your blurbs. All right. From here, you can also access the draft board package, which is the draft board the meeting slides, the infinite campus view, and syncing to the profile. So each one of those things that I mentioned um, do have their own videos. This is just an overview. Um, so keep going through the user guide for more information. In general, always make sure you are saving changes before exiting to your dashboard. Thanks.